Hi, this is Richard Liwani from Togo Photography and I'm here to do an unboxing video of the GoPro Hero 8 Black. Currently today it is April 10th, 2020 and right now on Amazon you can buy this guy for $300. Um, its original price was $400 so if you guys can hop on it, buy it soon. Um, if I can focus my lens here we can see the specs. It can take pictures at 12 megapixels it can shoot a max of 4K video at 60 frames per second or 1080p at 240 frames per second. The camera can slow down um, and take eight times the slow motion video. We got Hyper Smooth 2.0 feature right here and this pretty much means that it has a built-in camera stabilizer which will allow you to hold the GoPro uh, with your hands and take smooth steady video. We got the Time Warp 2.0 this will allow you to take time-lapse videos and manually uh, tell the camera to switch to normal uh, video capture whenever you want to and then you can switch back to time-lapse. Um, we've got the 1080p live streaming feature right here. It'll be great for video bloggers, whoever wants to just do videos on the fly. We got the live burst function here, this super photo plus HDR function. It can take pictures in raw format. We got here this little icon. So this pretty much means that it has these little flaps that can you can go ahead and uh, bring it down and you can mount the GoPro uh, on any mounting device. Uh, we got the voice function here as well as the normal touchscreen um, standard for the GoPro. We also have the uh, expected underwater feature right here. It can uh, go underwater uh, down to 33 feet or 10 meters and it also has a cool GPS built-in function here. Looking over here on the other side of the box we can see what's included. We got the GoPro unit here, the battery, the mounting uh, accessories as well as the USB cable. Alright so let's go ahead and dive into unboxing this guy. So here we got like a little cool little cool uh, unwrapping thing right there. I don't know what to call it. Strap. And we'll go ahead and open it. So looking at the GoPro, well, it doesn't seem to be any uh, typical plastic housing that I'm accustomed to. Um, so I'm coming from the GoPro 4, so I'm, it's been a while since I've had a GoPro. Um, so here, let me see if I can try to take this off, um, which I'll probably not. Um, I'll just take it off later, but this is great. So it has an adhesive from this mount to the box. It can go ahead and when, um, take the time to remove it and you can just stick that guy on like any surface. I normally like to stick it on to my computer tower. Going out the back here. So we got the manuals right here. Uh, the warranties and all that. So some standard for any electronic device. Coming out the back. It has what we have uh, said. Uh, we got your USB cable, your 3M plastic mount, your battery, and then that's it. So now this thing has a plastic piece right here just to help it hold up when it's being shipped and transported. So let me try to see if I can Let's try and take this out. Okay, so it's a it's a rubber piece, and you just gotta see how to pull it out. I'm just gonna push it, push this little um, these pins right here, and it'll slide out, and then this will allow me to remove it. I think. Will it? Nope. Looks like I got to unscrew this. Okay. So unscrew that. Alright, so there. And then 
this piece just should slide off. Hmm. Looks like it should just pop off. There you go. Okay. So that comes off. And then you have the little rubber strap right here. Or I guess this this rubber thing just uh, holds it in place, keeps it from shaking. Uh, you'll it'll reduce the noise um, when the camera is on a mount. So it was just this piece that helps it hold up during transport. Okay, so that's it. Um, okay, looking at the built-in mounts. So these things just uh, come out like this. You can just use your fingers to. Uh, bring it out Seems to be magnetized So it'll just snap whenever you want to put it away Seems a little flimsy. I don't know if It'll hold up. I kind of don't want to be using it looks like I it seems like I don't want to be using this on the uh, whenever I can uh, probably be using the plastic housing I got um, Just in case if this thing breaks you can replace it. I do see four screws right here, and this will allow you to replace it, but I mean, uh, I wouldn't want to be spending the money f to buy stuff from GoPro because they're like expensive. So I just wanted to show you guys an unboxing of the GoPro Hero 8 Black to show you what was in the box and how it all comes out. Uh, just to give you guys a first impression of the camera, it has a nice, sleek, smooth feel on the case. Uh, looking at it, um, Unfortunately, this does not come with a plastic housing, um, and so this makes the case vulnerable to scratches. As and also a major concern is that this lens does not come out, and you can't replace this guy. Uh, GoPro said that it does not provide any services to um, replace this lens, and if it did, it all, the cost of the service would um, be more than the actual camera itself. So that's a really big bummer. Um, that being said. On Amazon, there's this case right here that's being sold. Um, it's the Cupton waterproof housing case. I'll provide the uh, link of the description below. Um, this will allow you to take your GoPro 196 feet underwater. Just to give you a, a quick demonstration of how it goes in. Um, so just simply goes in like that. And the tight clip right here snaps like that and gives you a peace of mind that your camera is safe inside this plastic housing. It's pretty thick. Um, so yeah, I pretty much like it. Uh, pretty cheap. It was. It came out to $18.31 from Amazon. So yeah, it's a nice cheap accessory that will pretty much go a long way to providing you a peace of mind that your camera is safe from scratches. So until then, um, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. And please look forward to more videos from Torbu Photography. All right, until then, I'll see you later. Take care.